so for those of you guys who follow the channel, you know that I don't generally do negative reviews. Um, <laughs> and it, I don't know, but I'm, I'm, I'm going to do one today. I think, uh, I'll get your guys' opinion on this. So I, I just, uh, just bought three cases of these X MREs. Uh, had not been familiar with uh, this particular brand before. Says that it's a thousand calorie to twelve hundred calorie MRE. And okay, that's that's cool. That sounds good. I don't I don't find I couldn't find any information on how long the shelf life of these were on any of the uh, information that was on the website. I bought it from devore.com, which is, I, I think, a, a division of Optics Planet. And um, so I just got it, and I was looking at it, and <laughs> it sort of rubs me the wrong way, I guess. So three of the packages, well, let me, let me, move, let me move this stuff here. Try to, try to break it down for you in some way that makes Makes a little bit of sense. All right, so I started looking at one of them. This is the, this is what the the bag comes in or whatever. That's cool. Uh, and inside of it, inside of this one, you get uh, tortillas, plain. Then you get some apples, apple pieces, and spiced applesauce or spiced sauce. Then you get an oatmeal cookie. Then you get a package of uh, this Starkist Tuna Creations, which I actually used some of these in a recent video I did on making your own MREs. And let me see, this one was the one that was actually in this one. Look at the expiration date on that. Oh, it, it's best if used by May 15th, 2021. Um, so... <laughs> This is February of 2022, so that's not great. Um, and it looks like this stuff was was is two years old, which I don't have any problem with people selling stuff that's two years old if they tell you that it's two years old when they sell it or whatever. Um, it's also supposed to have like a like a wet nap and condiments and stuff in there, and it doesn't. It just has a fork and napkin. Which, whatever, that's fine. Everybody's trying to save costs and all that kind of stuff. I get that. Um, but it's just a little irritating to me when they do this. So if I'm reading the date code correctly, I'm going to show you this real quick. This is how they're, this is how they're saying to read it. <laughs> Which, maybe I'm reading this wrong, but... If it's, if it's this four-digit code right here, they would look at this, and then it'll tell you what day. So then they say over here, the example is year one is 2011. Year nine is 2019. So this is apparently year two. So that would mean 2010. So <laughs> that can't be right, right? I, I don't know if that could be right because then that means that uh, these are 10 years old. No, 20, 12 years old. Is that no way? I don't, I don't see how that, I don't see how these things, because um, I think these have normally a two year shelf life uh, off of the, off the shelf in, um, in the factory. And it's saying this one is May of 2022. So I don't know. It's confusing to me. I'm not sure what the deal is with the with the code and all that stuff. I've called their customer service and they have yet to call me back. So I will let you know what they say. But I personally would stay away from the X MRE brand if I were you guys. You get three in the, in the one case here, and I op I ordered three cases. I've only opened one. You get three of these meals that I just showed you that are the tuna fish meals with tortilla, which that's just kind of crappy as it is. It just <laughs> sounds like a crappy meal. Um, and then, trying to put these back over here somewhere. Oh, then you get some sort of a pizza, 
some sort of a pizza mix. You get a couple of those. Then you get a couple of Italian sausage with peppers and onions. And then you get a couple of elbow macaroni and tomato sauce. And then pasta. Pasta and tomatoes and sauce or something like that. Pasta with tomatoes and sauce. And that's what you get. So the menu selections aren't aren't wonderful. That's aside from the tuna, I don't really have any problem with the rest of these so much. But the tuna ones just seem really lame to me. That just doesn't seem like much food at all. But anyway, I guess it is what it is. Um, I'm not really good at bitching about things, and I and I don't really care too much. Uh, it was a it was a fairly reasonable cost point. It was seventy dollars for the case. Um, so it's not like it was a terrible price. But I'm a little confused on the dating of the whole thing, and then it irritates me that, that these these are already past their expiration date. Um, that, so that's that's just kind of crazy to me. So, well, two of them are past the expiration date. One of them is May 10th of 2022. And I know it's not the true expiration, and they'll last a lot longer, so, so I'm not probably going to return it. Uh, but I just won't be buying any of these in the future because they definitely don't, appear to be as hearty and as well packed and all that kind of stuff as a normal military MRE. So anyway, I will add to this video if I hear back from customer service anytime soon, I'll let you know what they say about it. I think the thing that irritates me about this is that when you purchase MREs from a store, you'd expect the date, the, the, you know, the, uh, the, good by date or whatever to be at least five years on MREs. Now they could, you know, military ones could last a lot longer than that. I've eaten ones that are 15 years old, but, um, it just, I don't know why it just seems shady to me that they're already two years old. They didn't tell you that they're, um, that they're, you know, older and some of the food is past its best by date. And yeah, I just feel like you should get at least five years out of something unless they say, Hey, these are expired. That's why we're selling them real cheap and all that kind of stuff. I don't know. Am I wrong? What do you guys think? <laughs> so I added up the calories in those tuna meals. And it comes to 890 calories total. All of it. Now, it's only 100 calories shy. 120 calories shy. Um, but when you multiply that times 12 meals assuming they're all the same. I haven't added up the whole case yet, but if they, if they were at least three of them, then that's 300 calories. If you do it times, uh, the all 12, that's 1200 calories. That's a whole MRE basically of calories that they're shorting you, um, in the box. And that irritates me as well. <laughs> oh, I don't know why this gets in my craw, but I just, I feel like companies are trying to take advantage of people more and more these days. And I think maybe we need to start calling it out when we see it. So that's the whole reason for this video. Okay, so done some more digging. <laughs> and um, it appears that my issue is, is more with DeVore and Optics Planet than it is with XMRE. So I go to their website, XMRE's website, it's xmremeals.com, check the lot number, and the lot number says that it is 31 March of 2020. Um, so it is two years old. So, okay, that's fine. And then their, their shelf life says that their shelf life is a minimum of three years. So they got 12 months left in them as at the minimum. Um, and then up to who knows how long if the package is unsealed. <laughs> that's what they say. But I guess my issue is with DeVore, um, they list it as a new purchase. So you should be getting something with pretty close to three year shelf life, you know, if not longer or whatever. Um, and, uh, the XMRE website actually lists that the blue line MREs, which is what we were looking at, um, gets, has 800 to a thousand calories. So it's a lighter version, but the DeVore website says that it's a thousand to 1200, that it's not the light version. Um, so 
and, and then they also picture Devor also pictures the the um, ration heater in with the with the MRE, um, and then says in the text below that it's optional, so it doesn't come with it or give you the option to order it. Anyway, this is just irritating to me. <laughs> Still haven't heard back from uh, uh, XMRE, but I'll let you know if I do. Okay, so I spoke with Devor Customer Service, and after being on the phone with them for like 16 minutes, <laughs> um, they asked if I wanted to return it, and I said, no, not really. It's kind of a pain to go and carry all these big boxes and return them and all that kind of stuff. And I said, I just want to let you know about it so you guys can do what you want and make it right, if you know, if anything or whatever. And uh, I didn't say anything about making the video or anything like that. And uh, they said that they would refund 10% of the money. So I guess that's better than a kick in the nuts. It'd be like 20 bucks back. Um, but eh, I don't know. I still think it's, it's kind of a crappy thing. But let me know. Maybe I'm wrong. You guys let me know in the comments below. Maybe this is no big deal. I don't know. Like I said, I just, I feel like we just, it, it uh, companies just continually kind of try to slide these things in there um, and screw you over, you know, at every turn, it seems like these days. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Take care. See you in another video here shortly. And don't forget to live the six Ps, proper prior preparation, prevents poor performance. Stay safe.